Dear viewers, in our previous lecture, we studied that how we can draw a structure on ChemDraw. In this video, we are going to learn some other features of ChemDraw and how we can draw some complicated structures. Like, I'm going to show you that here we have a metal complex with bidentate, biligand. Now, if we are going to make this structure in ChemDraw, we can import we can import it on ChemDraw like if we are going to double click on this structure it will appear on ChemDraw. Now we can make changes in this structure and again we can save in it on Microsoft Word. Let's suppose we are going to make some changes for example I don't like this this, this type of arrows So I am going to change these arrows with these arrows. So here, these are these are the bonds. We can pick this bond from these multiple type of bonds, and this is a coordinate covalent bond. So we can use this coordinate covalent bond from lone pair donor nitrogen to lone pair acceptor, which is metal atom. So here we can draw this structure like this. Now these changes will automatically appear on our Microsoft Word from where we bring this structure. So here if you look at here these structures these changes have been done. So this is very easy we can use we can change our structures on Microsoft Word from this ChemDraw software. So. We can also make this structure like this. If we are going to make this structure, I have already shown you that we will make this aromatic ring. Then we can add this bond and then, then another bond will be like here. It will be double. So we can click two times or we can take from this. We can take a double bond and then again, again, there will be a bond like here. So if you look at this here, so here this is carbon atom. Here it will be nitrogen and again we can draw this ring like this and other bonds like this, this and this and again we will add here aromatic We can undo this. Okay, we are going to delete. Now this is not in formula so we can add this in formula format now it is OCH3 okay so this is our first ligand and we can make other second ligand and copper inside okay <coughs> the next thing we can also draw these type of stereochemical bonds like here if I want to show you that here if we draw this 
like here it is outward in direction this is ch3 group okay and here is it is wedged here which is hydrogen so we can Now we want to save this file. So we, we can save this file as chemdraw file and we can use this file next time as this format. And we can also use this. We can also save this file as image file in TIFF format, JPG or bitmap image file or mole file also. Okay. So and again we can use this. Now we can we can add this for example we have selected this structure now we can we will copy it and we can directly paste it on here on our microsoft word so we can bring it like here okay so now this structure Now I'm I'm going to open this structure again in CamDraw, okay, and I'm going to show you that we can bring this structure in 3D format in CamBio 3D. We have another tool, okay, or we can analyze this. We can analyze this structure that it is correct structure or not. Then we can use this molecule and this check structure it means there is no error in this structure and the second thing we can clean up the structure so we can clean the geometry if there is a longer or shorter bond we can clean this geometry now this is the clean geometry of the compound and we can analyze some other like we can analyze its elemental analysis mass to charge ratio or molecular weight okay and uh, we can color different color we can use okay we can rotate this structure if we, we are we are not going to like this structure we can rotate it at 180 degree okay so it will rotate or we can enlarge we can scale up this image like for example we are going to scale it to let's suppose 200 percent So this is our second video after that after this video we will learn that how we can import this structure on other softwares and uh, we can also make this 3d structure so I am going to show you that how we can make it 3d so for example copy and now we are going to open cam 3d Now I'm going to paste here. Now this is our 2D structure and this is our 3D structure. It shows ball and stick model. We can change these models into stick format, wire format. We can zoom it, zoom out. We can also use some other formats. Okay, cylindrical bonds, space filling like this and some other features we can add here like so we can use some other features as well from this software we can change color so this is our cam 3d so we can save it in different formats okay now we, we can save it in as stf file this is another feature of this file and we can also save it in smileys so smileys are also important we we have to uh, use these smileys in different uh, web sites or different uh, different html websites where we can use these smileys to to import our structure okay 
so so today it is our second video so if you like this video please share and subscribe okay thanks